Hello everyone. Custom journal sequence module will allow users to create and sequence for an accounting transactions like invoice, bills, debits and credit note, customer and vendor payments and reconciliations. After confirming and once it is posted, the custom sequence that we have mapped will be created as a sequence and will auto-generate once it posted. After installing this module, now let's get into an invoicing under the configurations. So user can see an option for custom sequence. So here we can create an sequence for each and every journals. So in this, I'm going to add an customer invoices first. Now in this, I'm going to give the type as invoice and bills. And here in this, I'm going to give the sequence. So for this, I'm going to give the sequence as an invoice. Okay. So once it will be created, now let's click on and create an edit where we need to give a model. So I'm giving an account dot move. So in this, we need to give the prefix. So I'm going to give the prefix as invoice for an um, invoice sequence. Okay, and the sequence will be four. Now I'm saving this. Save this one too. Now let's get into an. Uh, invoices and create a new invoice so for this i'm going to add a product invoice date now while confirm yeah i'm just adding the customer over here now i'm confirming this order you can see that the sequence will be created okay now like the same way just getting into the sequence and create the same for a vendor bill so i'm going to choose a bill and also here i'm going to choose a bill okay so in this i'm going to give a code account dot move so example one i'm going to give the bill sequence okay and in this the sequence will be four same like invoice now i'm saving this getting into the vendor bill and just adding the vendor name bill and here i'm adding the product okay now i'm confirming it you can see that sequence will be generated now like the same way let's get into here and create for an uh, uh, debit note okay so here you can see the debits so i'm going to create a debit uh, here i'm just choosing and create an edit debit okay and the code we need to give account dot move which could be three so for example i'm giving so here i'm choosing four sequence now in this i created in uh, debit so i'm choosing a vendor over here products date i'm confirming this you can see the code which we have given will be taken like the same way let's get into the credits and you can just create it same like for m um credit also okay so here we need to choose a credit now i'm getting into here and choosing the prefix and account or move five so for example so here i'm going to choose four saving this and here i'm going to get into the credit note i'm adding the customer and also the products okay now i'm confirming this you can see the credit will be greater like the same way you can just make this for and payment also so for a payment you can choose and cash for example okay and i'm choosing a received cash sequence and uh, here i'm going to give the cash okay so here i'm choosing prefix as a cash and account dot payment you are choosing the sequence for same like before now in this if i just create any invoice for a customer okay now i'm confirming this order and i'm resuming the payment by using the cash okay now the payment will be created you can see the payment flow like when i get into here you can see the cash will be done so if i create it for a bank it will take the sequence from the bank like the same way we need to take okay so here for a bank you need to ch choose a bank and over here you can choose a uh, sequence type which one it will be and like the same way you can choose a bank over here 
so in this you can add a prefix or suffix or anything it will be and here you need to add an uh, sorry uh, here it, it, it will be anything so I'm adding the payment to so here I'm adding the sequence as a four so this is how it will work for a bank and like the same way you can just do the same for a miscellaneous operation if needed exchange differences and also the cash flow taxes for also the taxes you can just use a sequence like the same way which we did for all so in this way we can make use of this module to create and sequence for each and every journals that you can see in here you can just create and sequence you can just create and sequence for an accounting transactions like invoice bill, debit and credit note, customer and vendor payments and reconciliations. If you have any queries regarding this video, you can ask in the comment box. We will definitely solve your queries. And if you feel this video is helpful to you, you can like this video and subscribe our YouTube channel for more auto related updates. Thanks for watching.